and that's why she went to Jared. Visit the number one Land Rover volume dealer in the nation at Land Rover Manhattan during the Season of Adventure sales event. CBS FM proudly presents the final big show of the year. This Friday, live from Blythdale Children's Hospital in Valhalla, New York. And they're bringing along some friends to entertain the kids. Rob Thomas. America's Got Talent finalist, Sal Valentinetti. Billy Joel's sax man, Mark Rivera. American Idol finalist, Jax. And of course, Holiday Express. Sponsored by Valley National Bank. The perfect fit for all of your home financing solutions. By Lord & Taylor. The Dress Address. By McDonald's. I'm loving it. And by Regal Cinema. The Christmas Party for the Kids of Blythdale. Details at cbsfm.com. Over the ground like a mantle of white. Wondering how the hell. A heaven of diamonds shine down through the night. Two hearts are thrilling in spite of the chill. There you go, here's the clock that I've been using for the past few months. Love knows no season, love knows no climb. Romance can blossom any old time. This is a pretty neat clock. In the open, walking open. Definitely the reception is pretty good. The AM as well. I haven't tested long wave. And besides. Now here's a big question. How the hell did I get a Murphy Richards clock from the UK to work flawlessly in the USA? I mean, even considering this is a 240 volt clock meant for only 50 hertz. It's actually not that difficult to get it to run on 60 hertz on this clock. There's a clock circuit where one of the pins switches between 60 hertz and 50 hertz mode. And in this case, it was connected to the circuit board. So I have to disconnect the pin so that the clock can function in 60 hertz mode. And as you're seeing right here, it's keeping time flawlessly. Now, I, I am using a step-up transformer and another adapter. But hey, it's keeping time pretty good. And I'm impressed with the little clock. It's also pretty loud. And as you probably know, this is my favorite radio station, WCBS FM. Down here is that step-up transformer. As you see, it has the UK plug, the original UK plug that whoever bought it put on it. And you can still see the little paperwork on how to put the plug. Now, depending on the clock you got, you have to check the IC. Some of them will let you switch between 60 Hz or 50 Hz. I do intend on adding a switch so I could switch the mode from 60 or 50. But hey, this is a pretty trusty clock. Now, people are probably wondering how the hell does a Morphe Richards clock even in the US? I have no idea, but it was simple here. But hey. You've probably seen this clock on Instagram before. 